Hey friends, okay this video is going to be short and sweet and talk about this great dividend stock. I realize it's not a stock in a technical term but I'm going to call it a stock just to make this easier on everybody. What I am talking about today is Liberty All Star Equity Fund, I want to make sure I got that right. Uh, ticker symbol on this is USA, pretty easy to remember. I've been involved with this fund for quite some time now. I've hit uh, three dividend quarters with this company so far. They have always paid me dividends. They've always paid high dividends. The last dividend, um, well, the second to last, I just got dividends of this week, which is why I'm making the video, because it kind of made me think about what I was um, doing with this still sitting in my portfolio and I remembered how much I loved it. I kind of just I kind of just forgot about it because I've been so busy with Tesla with these EV companies and everything and then I got um, a reminder today that I got paid for it. This is a great fund to get started in. If you're wanting to get started in dividends and start receiving those, this is great because this is affordable. This is uh, right now what I'm looking at it early in the day. I'm we're at 601 and um, I try to buy this a lot. I haven't bought any um, this past month. Just like I said, I've been busy with all this uh, tech company stuff, trying to get it while it's low, while it's been being mutilated here this week. I'm going to go into a little bit of the company, just a quick brief, what they do, what they are. And um, I, I, I love the stock. It has never steered me wrong. Mutual fund, whatever you want to say here, ETF. It has never steered me wrong. Um, I, you know, it, it goes up very slow. It is very, very uh, slow how it goes up. But if it falls back down, which it did this week, because if you're in the stock market, you know what happened this week. It's already starting to go right back up. But I love these kind of stocks because they, when they fall, they just slowly go right back up, and they usually go higher. And that's exactly what this big boy does. It just goes, uh, it just keeps going, just going. And I don't mind that. I like it to stay. I like, I like slow growing growth. I like that because that means something good is going. That means you're not having a bunch of people just sell off, sell off, and then it just gets annihilated, like Tesla right now. So this first page, I'm on their website right now. You can easily go to it. It's pretty simple to understand. It's a good looking website. Very basic. Nothing crazy. Pretty easy to understand. Not full of, of a bunch of information. There's going to be some stuff on there you don't understand. I don't understand because, you know, I'm not a professional advisor at all. But here we go with this first page. The fund's assets are approximately equal, distributed among three value managers and two growth managers. And I've got this one colored in right here with seeks to invest in companies with predictable, sustainable earnings and cash flow growth over the long term. Long term, if you know anything about me, I'm long term, so I'm already in this right now. I love this right now. Then we go down to this next one I colored in. Seeks to own high quality, attractively valued companies that process Catalyst for positive change. I like all that. That sounds good. And here's the other ones, and I'm just skimming through this stuff. Just give a quick synopsis of what we're talking about here with this fund. Here's the next page over. Currently five in number, having different investment style recommended and monitored by the ALPS advisors, the fund's investment advisor. Here's 20 of the fund's holdings right now. I've highlighted them. The ones I've highlighted, you're just going to recognize. And these are some pretty, these are really big names. You know, these are like the biggest names you can, you know, understand right now and see. And down at the bottom, we got the Berkey. Everybody knows about the Berkey number 17. Big boy down there. So dividends. If you're watching this, you probably want to know about the dividends more than anything. Um, the last dividend, which was this week. And I'm on Dividend.com. It's a great website. If you don't know about it, go to it. It's great. Lots of information about the stock, ETF, mutual fund, whatever you're looking at. But this last dividend was $0.16 cents per share. The one before that was $0.14 cents per share. And that was like in the middle of the chaos with the world too. And they still gave out a dividend. So that's pretty big. There's a lot of things that did not give out dividends, which I'm sure you know about. And then the one before that was 17 Pretty much all the ones before the... You know the world came to a collapse where 17 cents a share that is a huge dividend that is for such as for something that is so cheap that is huge and it's pretty much every three to four months they're giving out dividends so listen i'm not a financial advisor this is just what i do this is something that i like to invest my money in i look at this strictly as a retirement fund i have not seen this 
really take a beating and took a beat when everything else did with the first talks of the world coming to a crash you know what I'm talking about with the pandemic -y. but um this is something that I really try to put a lot of money into for myself um, and I'm just putting this out here just to say hey look at it this is some information what I found on it I hope this was helpful I hope this maybe inspired you to look at it um, I love these guys Liberty All-Star Equity Fund check them out you might like them do some research you can do plenty of research on these guys they're great check them out like I said do your own investigation check out things don't ever buy anything before you do your own investigation see what's going on with the company check it out first thank y'all so much for watching friends I hope this video helped I hope it gave you some information you were looking for I'll probably do another video on these guys love them and I'll try to dig into some more stuff there's plenty more things to dig into as usual with most things in companies but um have a great day bye